Are your photo files a jumble of random names like IMG0123 or DCIM4567, making it impossible to know what is what? Let me introduce you to an incredible tool that will make renaming and organizing your photo files a breeze. A better find a rename for the Mac. The file names that some of our photo files get are, let's just say, not very helpful. So a better finder rename is a great tool to get all your files renamed in one go. But like any epic tool, it can be a little bit overwhelming to start with. So let me help you. By the end of this video, you'll know exactly how to batch rename your files quickly and efficiently, turning photo mess into success. So let's dive in. What is a better finder rename? Before we jump into the steps, let me tell you why this tool is a lifesaver. A Better Finder Rename is a powerful batch renaming tool for the Mac. It allows you to rename hundreds or thousands of files in one go and give it meaningful names based on date, time or custom text. You can use advanced options like numbering or replacing file names with metadata. For example, if you have a folder full of files named IMG001, you can rename them 2003 Summer Vacation 001 in seconds. Set yourself up for success. Before diving into renaming your photos, there is one crucial step that will save you a ton of time, setting up a clear and consistent folder structure. This is the foundation for an efficient renaming process, because we are going to use those folder names to rename our photos. Personally, I like to organize my folders by year with each subfolder being called the year and month, so my photos can be renamed based on when they were taken. If your folders are a little bit chaotic, now is the perfect time to tidy them up. You can do it manually, or for a quicker approach, use a tool like the Big Mean Folder Machine to automatically sort your photos into well-organized folders. If you're curious, I've got a video breaking down exactly how to use it up here, so check it out. With your folders neatly arranged, you're ready to move on to the exciting part, renaming. Step one, download and install. To get started, download a Better Finder rename from their official website. It's available for Mac users and offers a free trial so you can test it before you're committed. Once downloaded, install it by dragging it into your applications folder and launching the app. Step two, add your files. Now open a Better Finder rename and drag the photos you want to rename into the app window. For example, let's say you've just imported from your phone and they're named image one, two, three, four, five. You can drag the entire folder into the app. In fact, if you want to rename a whole hierarchy of photos, just drag and drop the top folder and make sure these subfolders is ticked here at the bottom. Step three, create the renaming preset. As we want to rename our files using folder names, we need to select a few naming steps to get there. But you don't need to do them separately. You can use presets in a better finder rename to lay out the steps to do it in one click. The sequence might seem a little bit backwards, but trust me on this one. In the category, select sequence numbers. Under action, select produce sequence number list. Start with one, step value of one, and then padding three digits should be enough unless you have a large folder of files. For change, this is very important. Select only the file name. Learn from my mistakes, I once renamed all of my files and removed the extensions. Bad idea. And to make sure that each folder is separately sorted, tick it and then it will start a new sequence of numbers in each folder. Tick the action on the left hand side. Now we need to add a second action. Click the plus in the action window and add another action. For the category, select parent folder name. Under action, add the folder name to the beginning. Tick to add a trailing space behind the folder name. And again, very importantly, only change the file name without the extension. Step four, preview your changes. Before renaming, a better finder rename gives you a preview of your new file names. Review this preview carefully to ensure everything looks the way you want it. Something doesn't look right, tweak the settings and check the preview again. This step is critical to avoid accidentally renaming files incorrectly. Step five, apply the changes. 
Once you're satisfied with the preview, click Perform Renames. Then click Rename All. The app will rename all your files in seconds, saving you hours of manual work. Step six, verify your files. After renaming, take a moment to double check your files. Open the folder and ensure the new names reflect your goal. So the image 001 is now 202301. And there you have it, how to quickly rename all of your files with a Better Finder rename. Bonus tip, save time with saved presets. Here's a game-changing feature. You can save your renaming settings as a preset. For example, if you regularly rename files to include a date and a custom label, save this as a preset. The next time you need it, you can just apply it in one click without setting up everything again. Just go to the presets in the menu and select to create a new preset with the current actions and give it a name. Then next time, go into the presets area and click on the preset and the little arrow to select and load the actions from the preset. And that's it. With a better finder rename, you can easily transform messy, meaningless file names into a perfectly organized photo collection. Beautiful. But what if you think you have a ton of duplicates in your photos? Well, then check out this video next to find out about PhotoSweeper, my favorite deduplication tool for the Mac. If you found this video helpful, then hit that like button and subscribe for more photo organizing tips. Have fun rediscovering your memories. I'll see you in my next video.